Well, we've been friends for a while. I guess I met you first when we I moved to the English because you were already there. Yeah. And then it wasn't until we became friends when I got older. So I started like having reaching out to more friends. And I guess that's just how that started. So I guess it just changed over time, obviously, because, you know, getting married. So the more we hung out, like, yeah, whenever we were at Jamil's house or with a group of friends, um, she had no choice but to be there because she couldn't get rid of me. So Pretty like, much. the more and more we hung out, the more we grew fond of each other. And then I was like, oh, he's kind of cute, you know, without the mustache, but it was there. So. <laughs> <laughs> I got rid of mustache in this. Because the mustache is an important part of the story. <laughs> okay, he's had a mustache like forever, for as long <clears throat> as I've known him. And I always thought like he would look better without it, but he was dead set, like I'm never shaving this off. And it wasn't until he finally asked me out. And like the day the next day, I was like, hey, so you should try shaving your mustache. <laughs> I told you I wasn't gonna shave it. And then, um, so then the next day I'm at my friend's house, I'm like, nah. I'm gonna shave it. I'm gonna see how it looks. I shaved half of it and I was like, no, I, I feel naked. And then I was like, I already started this. I can't stop now. But obviously it went for the better. And I was like, yes, the mustache is gone. And I'm glad it's gone. <laughs> yes. For me, there was, I can't let you get hurt anymore. And yeah. it was kind of weird. And the situation was, um, are you talking about with my friends? Some yeah, it was a couple of those situations. You always mm. felt and you always felt hurt. So I was like, I can't let her feel hurt or alone. Cause usually, you know, I tell someone like, like you'll give them advice or whatnot. Like you say your advice to your friend or whatever. But when you actually care about someone, you're ma more adamant about it. But when I realized on how I don't know, just how you made me feel. Like you made me feel like I was important and protected i guess and like loved <laughs> like i knew you really liked me but i just felt like you actually really truly loved me <clears throat> amanda lisa santana all right dear macho i'm so happy to give you a special kind of love from the beginning of our relationship, I love that you would always take time to understand me and let me be myself. To notice that I kind of maybe started liking him when I used to get disappointed when you weren't there. Because when he was there, it was like more fun, I guess. Like he just would make me laugh. Remember when I first asked you out and I bought you the BTS doll and you were in tears? It meant the world to me when you said yes to marry me. I loved how quirky and cute you are and never want you to change that. I will always be by your side through the sunny days and stormy ones especially. I'm so happy and excited to spend the rest of our lives together. So far, <laughs> I just didn't have my, my roller coaster moments. Yeah. You know, when you're in the moment and you're just focused and you have a moment to sit down. And stuff. But when I see her emotion, it immediately triggers mine. I'm like, stop it. Because <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy. Dear Macho, I am so excited to start this new chapter of my life with you. The day you asked me to be your girlfriend and the day you asked me to be your wife will forever be yes. I know that sounds cheesy, but it's the truth. I love so much about you that this letter would be too long, but I can still tell you a few things. 
Seeing your love and deep respect for Jehovah is one of the first things that drew me to him. I Jose Cruz Sandrana. You Amanda Lisa Santana. I Amanda Lisa Santana. Thank you, Jose Manuel Cruz Sandrana. I love how big and soft your heart is, even if you don't want to admit it, and how you're willing to jump in to help and save anyone, anytime, anywhere. Every time you hold my hand, I feel so loved and protected. I know no matter what we go through, we'll be okay, especially with Jehovah's help. I ask you to keep relying on me. I want to support you just like you do to me. Thank you for making me feel like the most special, beautiful person, even when I don't think so. I love you so much, <laughs> and I can't wait to wake up every day with you, tell you I love you. Today we start our family of you and me, and I can't wait for it to grow and live forever in paradise together. Love, Amanda.
love my life. I'm staring from my eyes. Isn't this crazy? We're married. Yo, telling me. <laughs>